and today with a 1080 resolution projector below the $100 mark which is not easy to find and actually it's the first time that we have both of these features on the same projector. This is the Ultimaia P20 and it's a 1080 resolution projector. Now if you are going to use it with your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer and you still haven't activated the license don't forget to check out KeysFan where you'll find budget official OEM keys at an affordable price and with the coupon code that you can see on screen you will get an extra 30% discount. So I will leave the link down below just below the Ultimia Apollo P20 and also a coupon code which will get 25% discount and you will get it below $100 mark which is just awesome. Now let's take a closer look at it. Inside the package we will find the projector, Apollo P20, some cables, accessories, a remote control, a manual. In terms of connectivity, we will have right over here two HDMI inputs, two USB 2.0, a AV in and also audio output. Talking about audio, if you want to connect it to a soundbar or a sound system that has Bluetooth, this project it as Bluetooth so you can connect it, including your headset if you want to. At the bottom we'll find the inclination knob right over here and if we remove the rubber feet we will have a quarter inch screw so that we can mount it to a ceiling mount or any other mount. In my particular case I have mine there on the cinema setup as you guys. I did replace my ceiling mount recently and at this moment I just need to put it up there because I do test out quite a few projectors and it's easier for me this way. So it will work on any surface or on any projector stand. Now in terms of resolution which is one of the best things that this projector has 1080 at a great price it's capable of outputting 35 inches up to 120 inches. For those of you that know my cinema setup on that corner I do have three meters away from my screen and I was able to get 100 inches. If we want to get the full 120 inches we will need to be away four meters from our screen and if we want to have a 35 inches screen then we just need to have one meter away. So possibilities are endless. We can do a office presentation with this or we can do the cinema setup for our family at the end of the night. Image quality is quite good following the Ultimia projectors that we have seen. Actually I'm not really sure how they could achieve such a low price with the specifications that we have right over here and the image that we have. We have vibrant colors as you can see right there on screen. I was using my Nvidia Shield TV with Netflix, YouTube and so so forth so I've spent quite a few nights watching TV and watching my series so today I just had to do some small recordings of the reality but the experience has been great and this is not only because of the resolution it's also because of the lumens and the brightness that it has. It has 300 NC lumens which is is the same as 10,000 lumens. As you guys know if you watched the video and if you didn't you just search the channel for my setup. I do have 30,000 lumens here on the office which is three times more than the projector so it's almost impossible to use any projector right over here. At this moment I don't have the 30,000 lumens turned on just half of it something like that but on the cinema setup I've got roughly 6,000 lumens and I always test out three different levels of intensity one of which is with 200 lumens more or less the second level has about 2000 lumens and the third level has 6000 lumens now this is much more than any living room that we have just because it's a place where I do my recordings and I do test out quite a few projectors but I was surprised on how good it behaved because even with the 6000 lumens we which in a normal situation we will not be able to do that. It did quite good. Now the colors looked a bit washed up and it's not as good as when we have a dark 
environment but just to see the brightness that it has it's quite powerful and three meters away from the screen so this was some good results that we had from this unit right over here sound wise not bad at all it has dual speakers here at the back that side of the screen and as you can see on this area right over here we've got the kfa2 3060 ti ex that we've seen last week and it's in very painted and beast in a very soft disguise and today we are going to take a quick so stereo and the experience overall was great the only thing that i did notice is that my voice has quite a few bass and watching youtube of my own i did notice that at the maximum volume we do notice a little bit of distortion but that was the only case watching netflix and watching other series and movies i did not hear that the first time that i did was actually when i was listening to one of my videos so probably the problem is with me and not with the projector nonetheless we will be able to use this as a standalone unit and then later on decide if you want to improve your audio system and connect to a soundbar which we can do via bluetooth and so on and so forth noise wise if we have the projector working on its own without a movie for example we will hear the fans like we hear on any projector actually i say fans because it has a dual fan system right over here which it's a smart thing because the dual smart fan will need to work less doing less noise which was a good idea on Ultimea but as soon as we put a Siri or movie then the sound just disappears even if we have low volume I do not hear the sounds and I've got the projector just above my head so the experience was really nice although I do suggest for a better experience using your soundbar or headset which will give you a more immersive experience lastly the size is quite small so although it's something that I usually don't do I do believe that its form factor will allow us to take it anywhere and do almost a portable device now it does not have a built-in battery so we will need to take our own battery connect it to any outlet that we have but it's quite small we can just put it inside the bag which actually it's not included probably that's one of the reasons that they could get the price a bit lower which if it was then i do agree with them but this is one of the case scenarios it's so small that we can put it anywhere in the desk can do a desk office presentation and a lot more only our imagination will be the limitation of using one of these projectors that being said this is a consideration for those that are looking to get a projector with a good resolution 1080 native in this particular case without spending a lot to have a different experience than what we have on our tvs we can go up to 120 inches officially but i can tell you that you can go a little bit more and you will not notice any image degradation so if that's your case and if you are on a budget this is so far the lowest price with the highest quality that we have checked here on the channel that being said hope that you guys enjoyed the video and if you did so don't forget that usual thumbs up right over there which is really appreciated on this side of the screen my name is roberto george and as always i'll see you guys on the next one